Oh well. Guess we'll uh, do Mando. The Mandalorian. Yeah, there's uh, Mando himself. Yeah, he goes by another name. I uh, can't remember it uh, correctly. But it's uh, really uh, hard to pronounce, though. I think it starts with G. I'm not leaving out any spoilers, okay? So you're gonna have to watch the show to find out what his uh, other name is. I highly recommend you to watch The Mandalorian if you haven't seen it yet. It's a really great show. Yeah. And in my opinion, is what um, Star Wars Episode 7 should have been like instead of THE Star Wars Episode 7. Okay, so let's get ready to build Mando. Mando is cool. <laughs> All right, it's no problem. You can always rearrange the pieces. There we go. We dropped the instruction manual. Didn't mean to do that.
All right. No, we didn't miss a step. Just checking to see if we might have missed a step. Yeah, confusingly, it's a darker shade of brown on the instruction manual, but it's a lighter shade of brown in uh, real life. So yeah, I can understand uh, why some of you might get confused. Alright, it's Mando. I'm excited to see the um, <coughs> the third season of The Mandalorian, although what would The Mandalorian do now that, well, you're going to have to watch the show itself to find out what happens, because I'm not leaving out any spoilers, okay? Yeah, it's see, kind of a, a rule of Star Wars fans, don't leave out any spoilers, or else you'll end up leaking something. I always learned that. Let's see. There we go. We found the other uh, piece. Okay, that's uh, one piece. That's a bit of a problem. The instructions tells you to do this.
look here, this. Even though if you actually do that, look what happened. The thing fell out. So we're going to put that off to the side and, well, focus on the other thing, which is basically the same thing, except mirrored. Yeah, it's literally the same thing. <clears throat> Except the step is mirrored. There we go. So, let's see if we can find some uh, black pieces. There, there's the one we want. Okay, and oh, look there. Would you look at that? Yeah, come on, get on there. There. There we go. Let's put the thing on the Yeah, you really don't need the instructions for the other side since well, it's a mirrored step. Well, aside from where to put the um, the two gray pit pieces, but you can pretty much figure that one out by yourself. So look, just a sec. It didn't take me long to figure out that it was just mirrored. That's how simple of a build it is. You always gotta appreciate the simple things in life. Right? So it's basically the same except it's mirrored. <clears throat> So the instructions for uh, the other side is entirely pointless. It's really just a waste of space. As long as if you figure out how to build it, you know what to do. There we go, that is pretty cool. And no stickers, means that takes us less time to get it finished. All right, get wind in there. This is the hardest part, trying to get the uh, the two pieces to align. Because sometimes they won't align. 
Да. Maybe it's uh, that piece that we got to remove. There we go. Figured it out. See, look, again, it didn't take me long to figure that one out. That's the fun of the uh, Lego, figuring out what, which pieces are arranged like a puzzle. Yeah, here's the fatal flaw with this set. You can never get the pieces to align. Well. Because the... Uh, those two pieces don't close off the gap properly. So the only fix, only solution is to, well, uh, try to put a piece down there. To see if, uh, it will align properly, because apparently we did miss a step. Although, again, not too long to figure that one out. And we... literally screwed up. Although, when you screw up, you can always improve on your mistakes. There we go. Now the things can clear the, uh, can clear the top. It's all about trial and error. <laughs> trial and error. Still won't clear the top. What the fr
All right. We might have missed a piece. There. Now let's see if it'll clear the top. No, it doesn't. It doesn't clear the top. Yeah, finally cleared the top. Now let's put even more pieces on there. Just and there's one last obstacle. Just make sure it doesn't fall out. Cuz you don't want that to happen. Okay, well, that's one, and that's the other one. Yeah, no, how can you screw something like this up? I know I screwed up. It's just that, uh... There are pieces out there that, of course, have to be arranged in a specific pattern. And no, that is not an epic fail. It's more like a uh, minor hiccup. It's not even on the same level as an epic fail. There we go, that fit like a glove, fits like a glove. Yeah. Even though I arranged them in the right pattern, in the right way, it's still wibbly. Okay. It's starting to look like Mando now. There we go. Now that is how it works. There's Mando. The Mandalorian. And there's
Mandalorian. All right, got that done. Except for one piece, well, two pieces to fill in the gaps. Look at that. It's like Funko Pops, except, well, or 8-bit style and definitely more cool it'll probably be more valuable as well don't get me wrong I like Funko Pops but nothing beats the feel of building a Lego set and like I've said I've transitioned from uh, plastic model kits to building Lego Speed Champion sets because I didn't want to deal with the hassle of having to build some uh, painful uh, plastic model cars. And I most certainly uh, would rather spend my time on uh, LEGO Speed Champion sets. I might do some uh, mocks in the future. Ugh, where, where the frick did the other piece go? There's another piece out there that looks like it, but it went away. Now we go unsolved mystery. Okay. Supposed to have like two of them, but look back in a sec. I gotta find uh, that other gray piece. It's gotta be around somewhere. All right, this is the part that confused me because I, because um, of the way this piece is built, I assumed that it would be the same except flipped over, but here's where it gets interesting. You listening? Oh, good. Yeah, the other side actually has a different step, which is crazy considering that in most other cases it's usually the same except flipped over yeah I'm used to having like the arms built in the uh, same way except the step is uh, flipped over okay so there's not much there that needs to be done aside from this part and this part. yeah we finally color, color coded the pieces so that we can actually yeah it's built in a different way which is rare usually the uh, other side is the same except built 
in a, um, well, it's usually the same except mirrored. And this is why we have this piece. I was wondering what, why it was there. Other than the different piece arrangements, it's pretty much the same. Except that the arm is placed in a different way. Alright, now let's flip it over. Ugh. There we go. Yeah, there's even more steps we have to follow. Well, you know what we can do? We can go on Facebook in the meantime. Because we have a lot more steps. And it's... I gotta talk to my friends. Yeah, this is even longer than the Baby Yoda build. and has uh, more uh, room for error. Alright, let's, uh, wait, forgot a gray piece. Yeah, it's supposed to, uh, top piece is supposed to represent part of his, uh, armor. And, of course, we actually got, oh, look, another piece. It's built differently. It, it's unusual that um, this happens in uh, these kind of sets. Because usually you have, like, the same piece. Like, well, it's with the case of the Baby Yoda s set, the Baby Yoda build. You'd have the same piece except mirrored. But this, you really gotta think. Yeah, it really makes you unprepared for what you have to build next. It completely uh, defies all uh, Lego logic. Because in the uh, usual Lego logic, the... Uh, The right piece and the left piece is, are basically both the same, except mirrored. But here, 
Both the left and right legs are different. It probably has to do with the fact of it uh, being so accurate as possible. Wait, we messed up. We didn't mess up. Because, well... That brown piece is not supposed to be on there. We actually did mess up. It was my fault. It's my own fault. Yeah. Yeah, it's interesting that they would go with this route. And we got the final set of pieces. There we go. Very nice. It's part time. Yeah, that was what I expect. What I was expecting the uh, left and right leg pieces to be like the same, except mirrored. Yeah, this set basically defies all Lego logic. And it means you have to uh, think but anyways we got the parts done yeah I'm not a fast builder okay now we gotta assemble another piece oh my god Oh, good. Yeah, this took so long that, uh... That I could actually talk to my friends while I'm doing this at the same time. I would message them on my smartphone. Yeah, let's see, uh... <laughs> the jetpack. Look at there. It's supposed to be like the jetpack.
Oh, look. We got it. Another thing to build. Uh, piece came off. Okay, let's rush build the other piece because, well, there's no point in wasting the uh, instructions to see how it's built. Except we built it upside down. There we go. If only we can get it on there. It's supposed to represent Mando's cape. And there we go. All we need to do now is to uh, to give him the lightsaber holders. And no, don't ask me why he has those things, because I'm not here to give out any spoilers about any Star Wars related content. Wait. There. That didn't take me long to figure that out. I didn't even need to go back to the instructions. Just kind of figured it out. And there's the icing on the cake. There's uh, Mando with his say, uh, Pistol. This is laser blaster. 
I know what they're called. It's Star Wars. Laser Blast. Yeah, they're called Blasters. Yeah, there he is with his rifle. And he even has a uh, actual sniper rifle just in case if you get tired of um, the more cartoony one. There we go. And he's built. Need I say more? Let's put him on the stand. Yeah, it looks good. Although we might have missed a step. Yeah, just in case if you get uh, tired of the other uh, blaster, you can always give him that one. So I like it, the fact that it um, gives you options. <clears throat> there, now it's officially done. Gave him his uh, carbine rifle. Yeah, looks cool. Alright, now let's go on to the end. Yeah, we uh, built Mando. Let's put Baby Yoda off to the side because it's not featured in this video. Yeah, Mando is definitely the harder of the two builds. And of course, took me longer to build. But the coolest thing is that you can uh, rearrange it. You don't need him to be holding that thingy. You can always get him to hold the, uh, the rifle. That is if you can actually hold it though. Okay, uh, you can hold it upside down. That's the best we can do. Yeah, that other rifle there is probably just for decoration. It's supposed to be holding that blaster. Yeah, Mandalorian. Harder of the two builds, but gives you more options. And, look at here. It's got a jetpack! He's Turbo Man! Yeah, Turbo Man. You remember, right? The, um... Superhero in, um... Jingle All The Way. You know, that hot Christmas toy that, um... The kid in uh, Jingle All The Way is always trying to get uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger's character to get him for Christmas, although... It's hard for him to find it, though. Yeah. And uh, Austrian Death Machine also uh, did a song about, um, well, a couple of songs about Jingle All The Way. Yeah. Pretty cool build, although it's pretty fiddly and um, takes longer to uh, complete than the Baby Yoda build. In my opinion, this is definitely the more difficult of the two builds. But it looks cool and is most definitely going on the shelf alongside 
Baby Yoda. And we also got another um, Mandalorian build, but we'll save that for May 4. May the 4th be with you. It's supposed to be a take pun on May the 4th be with you. Alright. See you guys later. Peace out. And may the 4th be with you.